Hey, hey, hey. Welcome back to Food According to El Roca. Hi, guys. As promised, here's the savory means recipe. Um, for the ingredients, we're going to need two to three cups of mincemeat, one cup of peppers, or robot peppers, half a cup of onions, two tablespoons, two tablespoons of tomato sauce, two tablespoons of Worcester sauce, one teaspoon coarse black pepper, one tablespoon brown onion spice, one tablespoon ground paprika, one tablespoon ground ginger, one tablespoon white pepper, one tablespoon green onion seasoning, one tablespoon barbecue spice, one tablespoon chutney, in this case I used Mrs. Ball's chutney, and we're going to need some oil to fry the spices. So guys, this recipe, like I told you before, you can serve this with uh, the fat cook, or you can make it with some rice, cook some rice as a side, and then serve it with that. It's very delicious. So guys, I hope you're going to enjoy it, and I hope you're going to try it and tell me the feedback about to how you found it after you tried the recipe. So let's go into the recipe, guys. So now you're gonna add your oil into into a into a pot and add all the spices. So as you can see, I used a lot of spices is to give it that deep, deep flavor. You know, it has to be flavorful, you know. So and then by frying the spices, we're trying to get all the flavor out of out of the spices. If you fry them first, then it's like you're opening up the flavor, make it making it very, very deep. So you put your spices in the pot with the oil and you're going to fry them a little bit before adding your onions and your peppers. Then you add your onions and your peppers into that mixture of spices. So my, 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 my peppers are frozen because guys, I always buy a bulk um, batch of, you know, vegetables. And then I cut them and I put them in the freezer. So even the peppers, I always cut, like buy a bulk of them. And then I, I freeze them so that I can use them as I need them. And then you're going to add a little bit of your Worcester sauce. Not all of it at this point. Just half of it. You're going to add the rest later on. Okay, now we are going to add the mince into the pot. And then you are going to fry it a little bit to mix it with the ingredients, with the spices and the peppers. And then you're going to add about a cup of water. Not too much, guys. We don't want to drown it. Just a, a, a cup of water so that the mince can cook a little bit. And then from there, you're going to add your sauces. And then let it simmer for a little bit. And then your, your recipe will be done. You can serve. So just a little bit of frying. So as you can see, I didn't put a lot of water in there. It's about a cup of hot water.
So once your your mince is cooked and then you start adding your sauces, that Worcester sauce that was left, and then you're gonna add the tomato sauce, and then you're gonna add some chutney. So the chutney is going to add a little bit of zing in the in the in the mince, make it a little savory. So it's going to be very nice. So as I said, guys, you can serve this with some rice and vegetables. Or you can serve it with, with the fat cook, the recipe that I made. Uh, before this one, there's a recipe for uh, a fat cook, puff puff, uh, maguinha. Then you can serve this mince with that. It's very delicious with that. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. And please give me feedback on how you found the video. And also suggest... Well, which videos you would like for me to make and i will definitely make them for you so guys thank you so much for coming back to food according to el roca